I sat down with Michael Needham's brother, John, to talk about what it's been like for the past six years. First three for me was anger, and then the last three's been, um, hmm, I don't know. I'd just say hard. Mm-hmm. Blue Ash police have never named any suspects or given what they think is the motive in the death of Michael Needham. John says he speaks with investigators several times a year. Because I want to just a, a reassurance that they're continuing to do what they're supposed to do. And then they give me a status report more or less on what they've been actively doing. And... Uh, it's a waiting game for me. A spokeswoman for Blue Ash says, quote, the Blue Ash Police Department continues to actively investigate the homicide of Michael Needham with the assistance of the FBI. Needham says he hopes bringing this awareness to his brother's unsolved murder will bring in the tip that helps solve this case. My hope is that something stands out for somebody that, you know, leads to something that pushes the investigation to where it needs to be, like gives us what we need. John knows the more time that goes by, the more likely his brother's murder will be solved through a tip that's provided to police. He does worry though. My greatest fear is that this will never get solved. But on another level, there's not an ounce of ability within myself to ever accept that as a possibility. John tells me that he's still holding out hope that someone who knows who killed his brother will come forward and bring the murderer to justice. He says without that, his family will never get the closure it deserves. In Blue Ash, I'm Christian Hauser. From breaking news to feel-good stories, Local 12 has it all. Tap subscribe and hit the links to find out more.